before we get started with this video, I just want to bring a lot of attention to this very special jacket that was actually designed and made by my friend Sparkle, who is in this video, and you will more than likely be seeing her more in the future on my channel. But just a quick look at it, it is so cute. And she made this herself. And if you are interested in ever buying some of her items or if you want to buy this jacket, I will link down below and also put her booking information and Instagram down below. OMB. <laughs> Good thing you can edit this. I started... <laughs> Hello. <laughs> hey guys. You're... <laughs> okay, so today I have my friend Therese here. You're... My name is Therese. I'm from the Bronx, New York, the best borough. Don't fight me, Brooklyners and Brooklynites. Um. <laughs> <laughs> so we're gonna get into our charts. I'm a Scorpio Sun, Aquarius Rising, and Libra Moon. And on the reverse, I'm an Aquarius Sun, Scorpio Rising, and a mm. Leo Moon. Full hair rip. One thing about astrology, when you're getting into astrology, it's not just like look at those little meme posts. It's like, oh, my sun sign is Scorpio, so. But I don't react like this. No, like you have to look at your whole chart. Yeah. So if you know like what time you were born and all that stuff, I'm going to link this thing so you can like look at your chart so you can see all the other aspects and it'll give you like a very long paragraph about the details of each thing so you won't be confused. So there you go. Exactly. Okay, so let's start with Aries. Okay, I love Aries actually. Um... If we're gonna rate like the different types of signs, you know, Aries, no fire is up there. Cause they're like very like, they're lit, like literally lit. So, you know, <laughs> like I mess with the Aries. One of my friend, best friends is the Aries. And you know, they're like very kind. Like people misunderstand them. Like they have a lot of fire in them and they're very, ah, cause they're like fire signs. But like, they're also like, it's, it's different about what they're like intense about. Like they're intense about loving people. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. it's not always like, I want to snatch this girl weave out. Like I think Aries are misunderstood for real. Yeah. Because I don't know. They just like having a good time, but sometimes they take it too far. That's <laughs> like, they do get carried away. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> so out of all the fire signs, what's the best fire sign? I, okay. It's hard to rank. Fire, I can tell you the worst fire sign is Leo's. Even though I love the Leo moon. Oh, also I'm wearing an Aquarius necklace because I wrap it every day. Cute. But like, I'm a Leo moon and I love that my moon is in Leo rather than my sun because it's like, you need to dial that back. You don't need to be all about you all the damn time. You know, and like, it's, it's just too much. So they're the worst. But I can't decide between Sag and Aries because I love Sagittarius too. But yeah. I, I feel like... The best fire sign will probably be, uh, it probably be Sagittarius, yeah. because they're very friendly and funny people. Like Sagittarius, Sagittarius, Sagittarian, Sagittarian, Sagittarius, Sagittarius, plural. <laughs> A lot of times they're like accidental bullies and stuff. Like they don't be meaning no harm, but they be mean. Like sometimes, yeah. Like, they're the type of people, like, they'll say stuff, they'll rub everybody the wrong way, and they'll be like, what did I say wrong? <laughs> right. <laughs> so, Earth signs. Let's talk about Taurus. Listen, my little brother is a Taurus, and I, okay, in New York, I was friends with a lot of Taurians, but now I look back, like, they're kind of, you know, teaching us a bit, like, trash i mean they're like you know down to earth because you know they're earth signs or whatever and they're cool you know some of them are really funny but like sometimes they just they're really good at holding grudges they're mad possessive and it's like y'all need to chill with that like chill like <laughs> services are just very they're very traditional like my way or the highway type i've noticed that a lot like they're very stubborn okay i know it's like cliche but like almost all Tauruses that I know are rude and stubborn. Not rude, but like, they just be like. Yeah, they're very stubborn, mad stubborn. What's the best earth sign? Best earth sign, Capricorn. Capricorn, I would say Capricorn too, that's what I was thinking. Cause like, one of my best friends is a Capricorn. <laughs> <laughs> and um, I don't know, Capricorns are really cool. Only thing about Capricorns is, um, they're often like, 
They're not good with emotions. No. Capricorns are like, actually like the real chill ones. Like Taurians, they try to be, you know, chill or whatever, but sometimes they, they come back to bite. Capricorns, they just be chilling, like. Yeah, when a Capricorn says they don't care, they- Like, they, they don't. Yeah. <laughs> Taurus says they could be like, I don't care, and then be in their room crying right. about it for the next three years. Oh, <laughs> uh, what about Virgos? I hate Vir Virgo men. I hate Virgo men too, and that's just the end of the story. Like Virgo men are great as friends because they're really funny, down to earth, and like they're caring, but not caring oh, enough to be your boyfriend. Listen, but they're not funny though. Like they're mad corny, and I know from experience. So I'm just I'm not with the Virgo men. Virgo women, on the other hand, very ethereal beings, like blessings to be around. Shout out Beyonce. <laughs> the queen of the Virgos. Exactly. <laughs> the queen of all the Zodiac. <laughs> Period. Like, I feel like Virgo men, they're corny, but like in the, sometimes in like a charming way. Not to me. I don't know. It just it's doesn't, I'm, yeah. <laughs> I'm just not compatible with Virgos at all, but I always find myself in a situation with Virgo men, so I'm just like mad confused. That's a sign. No, what it's not. <laughs> That's a sign I'm going to avoid. <laughs> Let's get into air signs. Libras. What was said? Um, like either I love Libras or I hate them because sometimes Libras are just like, they're fake. They give off this strong air of like fakeness, but it's not because they, they don't mean any harm by it. Like they're genuinely just like trying to be your friend, but it's also like, they're fake. <laughs> and my moon is in Libra, so I know about this. Like it's easy to be accidentally fake because you're really trying to be nice, but a lot of people don't see it, see it as that. But Libra Suns, except for my dear friend Sparkle, who designed this jacket. If you guys are interested, I'm going to link her website down below. Okay, so we're gonna move on. We gonna talk about Aquarians. Oh, what was said? The best sign in the house, the most legendary, the most iconic. But like, hello, we're the best. Like we get, we give the Zodiac life, okay? Without us, y'all would be very bored and it would be very sad. And you know, we're really the carefree ones. So we just the life of the party and that's period. That's all I have to say about Koreans. We're the best. I mean, sometimes you can be trash, but like I said, if you're an evolved Aquarian like me, I'm just the light in life, okay? Like, just flowers and rainbows all the time. And I'm I'm just smiles. Toxic Aquarians can be very um, aloof. Like, it's kind of like, they're the type of people like, they can literally like stab somebody and be like, you're bleeding on me. Like, but you just stab them because like they just don't, it's not like they don't care. It's just like, they don't care unless it's about them. Cause a, some Aquarians have a strong tendency to be self-centered. Yeah. Unevolved. I'm Unevolved. super self-centered, you know. I'm still the best, so. <laughs> Spoken like a true Aquarian. <laughs> okay, so. Gemini's, okay, fellow air sign, you know. I get along with Gemini's, but it's, it's kind of hard. I don't know. They're just like, you know, the two-faced thing. I never know which side they're doing yes. at the time of the day, you know? And it's like, mm, I just, I don't like unpredictability. Like, you need to be straight up with me, bro. I want my friends to be solid and for me to know they're solid. Yeah. And Gemini's like, it's crazy because I've been friends with a few Gemini's for several years. Not calling them out at all. Um, I have a lot of Gemini friends actually and sometimes like you could be the best of friends with them And then you'll still be in the back of your mind wondering like are we really friends? <laughs> like do they actually like me and like I don't know what it is about y'all like y'all give off this air Similar to Libra is like a little bit of fakeness Even when It's you an air sign thing. Yeah, it's gotta be air sign because Aquarius low-key have that vibe too yeah. like sometimes Same. it's hard to tell if like air signs really like you Yeah, we're kind of hard to read what do you think about Scorpios? Scorpios are the baddest in all the Zodiac. They are misunderstood. We are not all emo. I don't know why y'all think that. We are beautiful. Skirt. <laughs> we are like the best sign ever. We're so compassionate. A lot of times we're like psychic. We can see the future. We know you. 
we know ourselves <sighs> scorpios are trash and i that was so you know <laughs> scorpios are manipulative and that was an example that was <laughs> that's a whole lie what are you talking about <laughs> we forgot to mention cancers i'm no comment i mean you know like cancers 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 i don't like cancers too much they're just i'm not with the emotion but then on top of that like okay pisces and scorpios can be emotional but cancers are like mad manipulative with it like they know how to get under your skin so that you feel bad for them even when you're not supposed to. Yes! And it's like, bro, like, that, <laughs> don't do that. Cancers, <laughs> cancers are the kings and queens of playing the victim in every situation. Every situation. Like, I just said about Aquarius. No. No. Scrap that. It's cancers. <laughs> cancers, oh my god. A cancer will run you over and start crying because you put a dent in the hood of their right. car. And then make, make you pay for it because you feel bad for them. Mm -mm. The last time we're about to talk about is Pisces. Pisces. Um, <laughs> but like Pisces are so great. Like they're really loving. They're just like, I've never met a mean Pisces. Like they're all so kind and just all legends to be around. Yeah. Wonderful people. Pisces are beautiful. Well, I have met a mean Pisces. Um, some Pisces, I've, I've noticed this, like sometimes Pisces love and care so hard that they have a tendency to be kind of jealous hearted. But I think mm -hmm. that might be a water sign thing. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I don't know. That's unfortunate. Like, what's, what's cooler than the time that you were put on this Exactly. Earth? And like, even, and where all the planets were like. Right, like. So cool. You ain't even gotta like believe in all of it. But like, just think about the significance, like how cool it was. Like, this is where everything that in the so universe cool. was when you were born. That like so you, cause cool. you're special. Unless you're a certain type, but you have a certain type of chart, you need to be blocked and deleted from All right, that was the end of our video. I hope y'all liked it. Let us know what you think down below. What are the best signs, Scorpio? And, you know. All right, see y'all later. Bye. Bye.